In this video, we're delving in to Boost Turbo, a solution that's all about turbocharging your customer's storefront experience and decreasing loading times. The modern day shopper's attention span is quickly declining. And as an e-commerce merchant, every second counts. Keeping your customers waiting with slow loading times is a surefire way to get them to lose interest in your brand. That's why we are consistently evolving and upgrading our platform to ensure that we are performing at an optimum level to support you and your customers. Transitioning from the previous version to Boost Turbo means that our app seamlessly integrates lightning fast performance into your Shopify theme. With customizable templates and user-friendly tools to make your storefront stand out and perfectly match your store's identity. When it comes to efficiency, we have rigorously tested our older app version to the latest Boost Turbo and have found that both on desktop and on mobile, Boost Turbo has outperformed the previous version, showcasing its optimum efficiency. Let's take a look at how you can set up Boost Turbo in the dashboard today. When you land in the Boost dashboard from the navigation bar at the top, if you head to the profile icon on the right hand side, this is where you can access your account settings. So this is where you can head to app preferences to set up Boost Turbo. So from here, you can change the app language or choose a different app version. This is where you'll find the Boost Turbo version, which is the latest version of the app. As you can see here as well, we have several different app versions for you to select from, and it will outline whether you are using a outdated version here um, or whether you are in the latest app version. Also, please be advised that there is a guide here for specifics on switching versions of the app as well. We do recommend using the latest version, Boost Turbo, as this will help you access the latest features, updates, and app enhancements that are all here to support your growth as a store. So if we go ahead and select Boost Turbo and click upgrade version, you will receive this pop up here. This message will advise you that when you switch to Boost Turbo, your version settings will stay the same and that to avoid any problems in your store, we do recommend setting up different themes for each specific version. So setting up a Shopify theme for Boost Turbo and setting up a Shopify theme for the older app and then managing them using our app admin just so that you have a old version so that you can you know kind of track the difference and configure them to prevent any conflicts in your store so you can click don't show me again if you don't want these handy reminders and then to collect this click upgrade here it's also worth noting that the difference between the turbo version and the original version is the results shown in our recent performance speed test the results are that the boost turbo version outperformed the older version when looking at the mobile and desktop speed and the page loading speed and that the boost turbo version is 82 percent quicker than our previous version so to reiterate our boost turbo charged widgets can actually increase your storefront speed up to 82% to ensure that your shoppers aren't kept waiting. So once you've upgraded, it will outline this notification that tells you when you've upgraded successfully and that you can explore different versions of the widgets and the Shopify integration menu and watch some of our videos on YouTube. Then you can click here to go to the Shopify integration which is where you can connect Shopify to your Boost account. Now this is outlined in a separate walkthrough video to help you set up the Shopify integration. If you have any questions regarding Boost Turbo, however, please don't hesitate to contact our customer support team as they'd be more than happy to help. But just to reiterate, you can access a separate walkthrough video on the Shopify integration um, to set this up. But that in a quick overview is the Boost Turbo theme, how you can set it up within the dashboard and what this means for you as a store. Thank you very much for your time. Any questions, don't hesitate to shout. Thank you.